Meet Razorbacks commit Tink Hentz. Position, pitcher. If I throw fast, I want to throw fast. High school, Watson Chap. If I got a good off I want to throw it better. Hometown, Pine Bluff. Working to make sure that I can compete at any level. And he's pretty darn good at this baseball thing. Not even 18 years old yet, Hence is the 87th ranked prospect in the 2020 MLB draft. In a few months, he'll face the question of going pro or growing in Fayetteville. But for now, Tink is stopping to smell the roses. Well, it's like an honor to be able to have two between the two goals you had since you was little. So, every since I was little, my dad and dad threw my feet, and like, I was like, I want to be a baseball player. To me, I just... Look, just wherever, wherever God's plan, wherever the best choice for me to take. So I'm just hoping that wherever comes, just you know, the best in the long term. What helps separate Tink's game can't be measured with strikeouts or ERA. Like as a teammate, I'm here for wherever. If we win, I'm gonna cheer on. If we lose, I'm gonna make sure I can pick you up. And then towards like the player part, I'm like I'm real competitive. Like um, it don't matter who's playing, I'm gonna compete and do give them the best I got. Being a born and bred Arkansan isn't the only reason Tink is hogbound. It's the fan base. Growing up, we used to have a tournament, you took a little say tournament up in Fayetteville, and every time we go to the tournament, coach to uh, get us tickets to the game. Yeah, just being in there, the atmosphere, like how all the fans reacted and appreciated their players would let my children. And it's the coaching staff. Just like the knowledge, like they knew like so much about baseball, like they explained to me like how they can develop me, and that's what made my choice on that side of the court. As a senior, Hence had his high school career abruptly cut short, but Watson Chapel coaches gave Tink and his teammates one last memory on the diamond. Well, like coach was like coming in, just checking on us every week, just because like we still had a chance to continue the season. Like, everybody was just trying to keep having a good mindset, like, the season keep coming, just keep working out, the time going to come. A couple of days ago, like, we had our banner set up, like, around the fence, and he, he just had, like, a little ceremony for us to come out and, like, leave the field one last time. Like, he had the nice. scoreboard with all our numbers and stuff. So, awesome. like, that was, like, to show his appreciation for all the scenes. Keep an eye on Tank as the draft and his potential future as a hog approaches. Nick Walters, Fox 16.